I'm Guy Kesteven and this is a video I never wanted to make. Uh, it's my first ride out since Mike Hall died. No Mike since he was a lad of 15. We used to come down here mountain biking. He was my sorcerer's apprentice on Maximum Mountain Bike magazine. Uh, that was a super keen mountain biker. First got in touch with me building his own downhill bike for a school project. And most people were doing bookshelves and uh, bird boxes. Mike wanted to build a full-on downhill bike. Obviously, being Mike, not just any old downhill bike, it had a particularly clever eccentric suspension system and uh, he was already talking about viscoelectric shock damping by the time he was in sixth form, but... Uh, it was already a thoughtful week, but everything on Friday really put that into perspective. You know, I rode down here after Steve died. I rode down here after Charlie Craig died. After Jen Hill died. And, you know, mountain biking has always been a big part of me coping with stuff. Mike and I would often come down here and absolutely beast each other. Laughing, fighting for different lines. It'd be appalled how slowly I'm riding today. But it's definitely a thoughtful, you know. Definitely a thoughtful ride, this one. I should probably go out and smash it. I'm not there yet. Sorry, Mike. Just not quite there yet. It'll come. Plenty more water over the bridge, over the weir. Things will go on. Things will go on. You know, the transcontinental race will happen. And that was, you know, that'll be very important that Mike's legacy is continued on like that. And we all go out and ride when we can. And now yeah, Bruce Dalton summed it up beautifully. Be more Mike. But be yourself as well. Mike was an individual. By God, he was an individual. He was a determined, stubborn individual. Sometimes like it feels like you're paddling upstream on the river. Sometimes it's flowing behind you, pushing you on. Just make the most of it. Find that fire in your legs, that fire in your heart. And let it drive you and become memorable yourself. It's what Mike would have wanted. I'm going to miss you, Michael. Miss you dropping in after every adventure as you're passing by. Telling us what daft adventure you were going to do next. Even bigger, even more impossible. But you did it. So let's push on everyone. Let's keep him alive through what we do. Keep Charlie's memory alive, Steve's memory alive, Jen's memory alive. Not by sitting moping. Like going out and hoping, hoping for the best. Hoping to be our best, hoping to do our best. Thanks, Mike. You're one of the reasons this place is special to me, and why riding is special to me. And uh, thinking of you for a while will make that river a few tears deeper, to be honest. He really was a still water that ran deep. But I was honoured and privileged to share some time with him. Michael, ride in peace, my friend. Ride in peace.